Hello everybody, welcome back to some more Terra Tech. Make sure you leave a like if you want to join and want to see some more in the future. We're still with our little, tiny, relatively little and tiny beginning Terra Tech vehicle. We're over at the Trading Depot and watch us to purchase a tractor pad to begin harvesting resources. Tractor pads allow us to pick up resources, carry them over and sell them. Where is the tractor pad? Right there. So we got to send, we got to spend 123 BB. <laughs> I never did figure out what that meant, so I always called them Blitz Bucks, because uh, my buddy Blitz was the first person I saw uh, play this game back in the day. He's been playing it for quite a long time. Oh! Oh, it's Noob123. Oh, he found us. Oh, you stinker. Okay. He's got a little bit more firepower than us. Oh, he flipped over. Oh, we can do this. We got this. We got this. Oh, I'm stuck. I'm stuck, and he's stuck. He flipped back over. Dang it! Oh, no. Are we going to blow? Oh, come on! Oh, God. Oh, did he blow up, too? What the hell was that? Okay, I gotta turn this down. Oh, that was stupid. Somehow, we blew each other up. That was a little embarrassing. Was not expecting him to be over there. Can't even drive this itty bitty thing. But luckily, we got a metric butt ton of parts all around now, so we can build something pretty massive and pretty badass. First things first, let's just strip everything off. And we must protect the cab, so I'm gonna try and do a little bit better job of protecting it by encasing it completely and these blocks uh, by quite a few in the front as well wow that new guy gave us a lot of blocks thank you very much buddy you, you're you're a credit to your race I don't know is it a race they're all just sentient robots I guess it's technically a race of robots just feels weird calling it that alright so we've got them completely encased now looking pretty pretty good sun's going down that's not good. Actually, it's fine. It's just it just makes it harder to see at night. It's not like it's the game gets more difficult at night. Uh, do we lose some of our off-road wheels or dirt road dirt wheels? I know I keep forgetting them. No, actually we've got even more. Uh, so he must have had some on him because we only had four initially, but now we've got quite a few laying around. These are all just regular little itty bitty ones. I just need one more. Uh, they're not anymore. Ah, I see them way up there. Beautiful. Actually, two more would be great. There's one there. And one way up there. Fantastic. Okay, do we have enough blocks to finish up back here? Yes, we do. Very cool. Uh, I also want to add some more up here. Just to kind of protect that. And give us another row of guns. Because uh, the higher you have it, the more uh, guns you can kind of stack and all have them face out at the same time. So let's put these lasers on the side. We've got some laser beams. Put the machine guns. The lasers are important because the lasers don't have any drop off, but the machine guns do. So if you want to shoot someone from very far away, you shoot them with the lasers. <laughs> I don't, I don't know what that voice was. That's like my go-to like a uh, stereotypical cartoon nerd voice. I don't know. It, it probably stems from some sort of Simpsons reference. It's probably characters that sound like that. Cause I freaking love the old Simpsons. I haven't watched it in a long time. Seasons like 3 through 10 are some of the best television ever. Everything else has been like, meh. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna rant about The Simpsons. Like today on CTOP's Random Rants, The Simpsons. Oh baby. Oh, we got a whole mess of lasers now. Sweet, sweet Christmas. Okay, let's add the machine gun back there. Uh, should we get a drill up front? What is this? What is this? Oh, more machine guns. Okay. So that way they can shoot people behind and in front of us. Uh, we're also going to grab this guy. Let's take him off. Right click. Have him shoot backwards. Actually, we're going to have him shoot to the right. There we go. Just in case. We'll take a drill. Put it up there. Okay, and I think that's all the parts we're going to use in this area. we got some more wheels and stuff all around. Oh, actually, there's one right there. I keep missing them. There we go. Looking all right. Got some blocks. Another laser over here. Let's just throw that there. Have to fire that way. Cool. Got it all good. We got some blocks around here. Now blocks, when they're just on the ground, they eventually do despawn unless you kind of anchor them, like by putting them on stuff like this. So we may actually just grab some random blocks, chuck them on there, repair everything up, and should be good. Oh, it's draining the battery right now. Okay, that's one downside. Ooh, there's an enemy camp over there. Wheels overloaded. I think it's because it was like stuck up on that. Oh, uh, we'll probably tack that camp in the morning. Where did our tractor pad go? What is this? Oh, it's another bubble. Okay. Um, where did that tractor pad go? That's something we actually need 
to send in resources. Because you can grab little resources like this piece of wood. We can uh, bring it over here. We can chuck it on there. So you'll see it'll get absorbed. And we'll get six blitz bucks for it. It'll shoot up in the space. Magical. I think we can do it with like weapons and uh, blocks as well. Let's just take that guy. Add some more rear firepower. And actually, uh, I'm running out of room here. Dang it. Let's just get this guy. Do that instead. And maybe we'll sell this machine gun. See, you should be able to just take it in there. Load it up in. Pew! It just like shoots it into space. That's the kind of the backstory there. It's taking all the... Oh, 125. Okay, that's much better. But now we should have enough to go buy a tractor pad. Just one. Just one for now. So we take the tractor pad. We drive over to resources. And it can hold three at a time. So this is the very basic tractor pad. Can't do too much with it. But you basically load up your tractor pad resources, take it over these things, and it'll sell it for you. Eventually, you can actually build some of this on your tech where you'll have a tractor pad and um, uh, the little conveyor belt systems and refineries. So it'll actually take resources, refine them, and then bring them over. What is this? That's something else. I think it's like a resin. So we can take that in there. They'll all start loading up, and they'll shoot in space. Ooh, there's planets in the sky now. Look at that. Look, there's a moon over there. Ooh, there's a couple different planets. Very cool. Yeah, there wasn't really a, a skybox back when I used to play. At least I don't remember. It was over a year ago, so come some slack, Jack. Oh, and I just didn't even notice. Where the heck did my tractor pad go? Did it fall off? What the heck? Uh, did anyone else see that? I may actually go and review the footage, because I have no idea where... Like, we went and we took this stuff over here. We dropped it off. And now my tractor pad is just gone. Okay, can we sell some of this stuff? Just to try and get some money to buy another tractor. I don't see it in the area. Did we accidentally sell it? No, because we don't really have that much money. So it's not like we sold it accidentally. That's a bit weird. If you ask me, but whatever. Alright, sell this stuff. Let's buy another one. That... Did it get... It didn't get destroyed. I am so puzzled. I am very perplexed. We'll put some little wheels on it. Nope, not on the bottom. On the side. Uh, let's sell some more stuff and just get a second one. There we go, we got our second tractor pad. Grab, uh, that's a little rear, rear wheel. There we go, saying again. Okay, is this what happened? I got stuck under there? <laughs> Did I didn't tear it off or anything? I don't know. Well, let's go grab a little wheel for the left side of this, and we'll try and find some better resources to collect. So these things are actually awesome. If I remember correctly, these are emeralds. And so we can grab some of these. Things do give you a lot more money once you actually refine them, once you build a refinery and stuff, but... Right now we don't have a refinery. These always look like uh, crunch berries, <laughs> like Captain Crunch. When they have the little crunch berries in them, that's what they always look like to me. Because when I was little, I used to play this game. It came with my Captain Crunch, and you like you'd raise these little crunch berry animals and <laughs> like train them to skateboard and to like jump over things, and like you'd have Olympics. It was weird. It was like when the games used to come with cereal boxes with a little demo CD. It was, it was pretty funny. I just remember playing that with me and my brother and my sister. We would train different crunch berries and see who had the best crunch berry in the family. Alright, I'm feeling ballsy, so I think we're going to go attack that camp. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to grab our... Uh, not the repair bubble. We want the uh, shield bubble. We're going to grab this. We're going to put it, I guess, just in the back. We're also going to take this battery and power it once we get over there. Just so we don't waste any power. Okay, because there is a guy guarding it. Let's go ahead and power up and attack. Grabber JJ. Let's get him. Oh, we got this. We got this punk. Come here, you. Come here. But look, we're <laughs> I just realized our shield isn't even covering entirely our front. So yeah, positioning is important because <laughs> you see how it's not actually protecting the front of us. Oh well, but look at this. So we've got a... Ooh, is that actually a refinery? Can we use this? I don't know if I can grab it. I thought... Like, do we not own it now? Let's see, if I take this stuff and put it over here, will it not sell it? No. I thought I get to control these now once I t take them out. Do I have to, like, destroy the bubble? Let's try that. Oops. Well, I think, <laughs> I think I shot it a bit too much. Let's see. Ooh, we do get it now. Okay. So what is this? This is... Oh, I think this is the thing that actually delivers it into space. So if we take stuff... Like, uh, like this block. Or no, that's not working. What is this? Okay. Oh, we did get another, uh, 
So we can't get until it breaks off of it. That's so weird. Huh. Okay. Uh, we'll just leave this here for now, I suppose. Just, no, we'll just put it on the ground. Just put it on the ground. There you go. Player Tech 2. This will be kind of our other base. Because these things are conveyors and stuff, so that actually holds things to sell. But for now, we also have... A couple of missions I want to check out. So we have find missions in the world to earn XP, defeat Big Scoop. Apparently there's a guy named Big Scoop out there. Oh, I see him. Yep, should we go try and defeat Big Scoop? Let's grab our a battery. It's right in front of us. Okay, and let's go try and take out Big Scoop. I want to. I need a better place to put this to put the uh, bubble. So we'll actually take off this gun. We'll just store it there for now, and we'll put the uh, bubble right here. And then attach a shield to the front, or we'll attach the battery, so our front wall should be shielded. I think that'll be a little bit better in the long run. This is an interesting looking biome. I don't think I've seen these ones before. Alright, big scoop. I'm coming for you, punk. Get ready to face the thunder. Okay, he does have a big scoop. Do we even need a shield? Uh-oh, we've got an invader. Oh, invasion in 26 seconds. Okay, can we defeat big scoop before that? Invaders are basically really difficult boss fights. And they'll arrive right here. Uh, we don't really want to try and beat them now. Or we could, just to show you guys, but... Oh, there we go. Geocorp license upgrade. Fantastic. Uh, I guess we'll just check it out. We'll, we'll see what the invader wants. We'll see how tough he is. If he's too tough, we'll just run away. They tend to be pretty slow, if I remember correctly. Like our gun shooting into space. Oh, we've been invaded. Oh, from Payload Studios. Okay, well, let's back it up. Back it up. Back it up. Back it up. Keep backing it up. Okay. Oh, uh, can we take this guy? I don't know. I don't know. Actually, I think we can. He doesn't seem to be doing so hot. Oh, we got this. Look at that. We defeated Track Tractopus from Payload Studios. Awesome. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, so you can be invaded by other people's designs. And that was actually Payload Studios, which I believe is the dev. And look at these things. Okay, see, these are big tractor pads. So these actually hold uh, a lot more. I think they hold 12 as opposed to the three of these. So that's awesome actually. Great pickup there. We're gonna use some of these blocks too to kind of uh, extend ourselves a little bit. Alright, looking pretty good. I added a layer to the front and to the back. So now we can actually have this guy shoot backwards. We'll, we'll just store the battery there for now. Let's shoot backwards as well. And that one. Look at that. So we've got just death at all angles. We got a flatbed tractor. Oh yeah, tractor. Okay. Uh, but I think two of them are good. They're probably better suited to be on the front, but we'll just keep them there on the side for now. Uh, we'll just bring that tractor pad with us. Why not? Let's put a little wheel on it. <laughs> Make it a little bit more secure. And yeah, let's just move on. Let's go check out some of these Geocore parts, because we do have them now. The big yellow parts. They're a lot better once you start building uh, bigger techs. Let's grab those things, bring them over here. But the question is, do we want to do them yet? Because we're still kind of just stuck... With our little one. Ooh, there are four wheels here. Hmm. I think for now we'll just stick with this tech. Kind of build up from here. Uh, we'll, we'll start building with these things in the future. Let's see. Do I want to keep some of these? I could just like bring them back to base. Nah, we're good. Let's go fight this guy. OP. 3, 2, 4, 3. OP my ass. Come here, you little goober. Come here. You little goober. And people, people do say I throw that word around a lot. I do say goober a lot. It's a fun word, right? Goober. Everybody likes it. It's a good way to describe it. little things. They're all little goobers. Goobers and goblets. Nah, that didn't really work. Whatever. Uh, no real space for any other weapons on. Oh, wait. We lost one in our front. Okay. We'll replace that laser beam. Sweet. G Corp. Small stock. What is this? Small stock. I don't know what this is. Small shock. Oh, I was reading that wrong. Shock, huh? There's a way you should be able to, like, click on things and it gives you information? I that's how that worked. Oh well. We'll see, because all this stuff should be available for us to buy in the Geocorp uh, from the from the trading depot. We can actually buy things for the Geocorp now, since we did get our license upgraded. But let's grab some of these cool little blue resources and start loading them up. Let's see, is he going to tell us what these are? What, what What is this? I don't know. That is a real pretty looking sunset. They've really done a lot with the... Uh, the skybox and lighting this game. Really nice looking. I like it. Uh, where's our base? It's over here to the left. Uh, do we want to fight this guy? Oh, all stuff in the way. We'll just grab one of these tractor pads. Bring it with us. Why not? 
Nah, we'll leave him be. He's not hurting nobody. He's just hanging out. Doing his thing. This guy's a little bit close to my base. Keep your distance, buddy, or I'll make you sorry. You'll be sorry. Kiwi Mobile. Oh, I wonder if it was built by my friend Tiny Pirate. Funny inside joke, because, oh, he's he's from New Zealand, so I guess, it's not that funny. <laughs> kind of a stupid joke. Dang! Are we getting 220 BB for each of those? Wow, okay, well, we are rich now. BT dubs. Well, let's just toss that tractor pad up there. Let's get that out of here. We don't need these things. We got these big tractor pads now. We've outgrown them. Yeah, so now we can just drive over all this stuff and it'll just pick it up. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. Look at that. We're already making cash right now. Already at four grand. Woo! Woo! Grab some of these emeralds. <laughs> We're like destroying trees way off in the distance. Oh, this is this is not a game for environmentalists. <laughs> We're just knocking down trees left and right. Look at all this. Ready? Bam, bam, bam. It just sucks it all up. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, is Kiwi Mobile coming over here? You want to dance, dude? Okay, that is a really annoying. That keeps happening. Anytime I have something on the front like that, it just kind of breaks off. Let's grab our battery and actually put it over there and let it recharge in the morning. Oh, Kiwi Mobile. Dude, you picked the wrong... Oh, he's got a little scoop. Those things are cool. You picked the wrong guy to mess with, buddy. I'm not your buddy, pal. I'm not your pal, guy. I'm not your guy, friend. Oh, South Park references. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, we picked up some random wood. Look at it. It's still selling all this stuff, so it's taking forever, but look at that. Making money. Not, wood's not even worth selling once you get to a certain point. Like, already at the point we're already at. Not really worth to sell the wood because it's not really worth much, but it is plentiful. There's some big goober out there. Look at him staring at me all menacingly. I see you out there. I think you're so cool. We'll probably go fight him in the next episode, guys. Make sure you leave a like if you are enjoying Terror Tech. If you want to see more in the future, let me know in the comments below. Things like that. I'll see you guys next time for some more T-Tech, as I like to call it. You know, because we're really good friends. So we have nicknames for each other. He calls me C-Twizzle. Who's he? Uh, the game? The game calls me something? That doesn't make sense. I don't know. What was I doing? I uh, was saying bye. Bye.